Color Guard members are preparing for future Spirit of Worthington marching band and performances. This year for the Color Guard, Sayuri Salazar, a former section leader, and Kaylee Bongchong share about the routines and how the new members are doing with the routines. I think this year it took pretty much like two weeks, but it was pretty much just learning it and just cleaning it up. A lot of them caught on a lot quicker, but some of them did have some difficulties learning. Um, just a lot of practicing and cleaning our routines, just going over small stuff and really just getting it in our bodies. And I'd say probably our rifle routine. Our rifle routine is pretty hard and it's just a lot, especially for the new people in Color Guard, but we'll get it eventually. As a first year Color Guard member for Worthington High School, Marilyn Castillo shares about how she feels about the transitions in the dance and going into different routines. I wouldn't say it's that stressful, maybe just transitioning and then going into um, the different routines and just doing it really quick is pretty stressful, but that's basically it. Many people have had different thoughts on the Color Guard's costumes and Kaylee thinks the costumes really add to the show. So. Our costume is like the colors of New York because our band show is like New York. So it's blue and orange and we're supposed to be like businesswoman, you know, so businesswoman in New York. So that's basically our costume and that's who we are in the show. I think it really adds to the show along with the props and the staircases and our flags. It really just adds to the show and like tells a story. Let's cheer on our Color Guard members as they twist, toss, and twirl through the season. This has been Carly for Trojan News.